From Las Vegas, it's Let's Talk News Now with Rick and Ella. And welcome back to Let's Talk News Now. Of course, we have Chef Q here with us. Hello. 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 Wine. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, okay. As I was gonna say, the ladies are finally getting their wish. They're gonna be able to start drinking on the set at six oh, six thirty in the morning. There we go, we got it. Why not? There you go. Yeah. Why 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 not? Not why not, I didn't say that. Yeah. Here's the I asked Chef to please help me out. Okay. And so she's designed this whole thing today for based upon my one simple request, which was Chef. Okay, people come over, wine and cheese is really easy, right? Bring out a couple bottles of wine, bring some cheese out, cut them up, put them on a plate, I look good. And I look sophisticated, <laughs> okay? <laughs> Providing I've made the right choices. Mm -hmm. Now, when I go into the wine section, it's like vintage USA. I mean, I just, there's this manufacturer and this winery and that winery and there's Different crackers and there's different cheeses and some cheese. Yeah, I just come on. What well, you know? What just a block of cheddar and a glass yeah, and a box that? wine and that's can not it. Box wine. <laughs> <laughs> so, chef, help me out here. Do the really expensive crackers make really the best crackers? Um, I don't really go with that belief because <laughs> there there are so many uh, choices on the market that you literally would have to taste every known cracker to man. And I can't make that as a blanket statement. I mean, I find out when I'm consulting with my clients or when I'm doing a wine tasting in different environments, I go by what their budget is. It's very simple. And then I go into the stores and I start looking for what it is that I would like to, you know, uh, present in that. So um, what I've done today, based on our previous conversation, sure. is I have picked two wines. I have picked, these are both Italian, and they're from an area in Italy, central Italy, called Falerno del Mas Massico. And what it is, is it's on the slopes or the, of the Mount Massico. So I find that they are a very, whether it's the white or I'm the red, they're very rich. Very rich and full body. Okay, so you're gonna pour that and for that. me. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have you taste uh -huh. this white. Uh -huh. The three of us, the four of us will do it at the same time. Okay. Very simple. And I'm going to... You're gonna swig it from the bottom? <laughs> <laughs> no, I've already tasted it, believe me, many times. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is I just want you to take a... Do you smell it? Just, okay. just check the aroma. Okay. And smells like, really good. What do you smell? Smells. I mean, each person has their own distinct smell. Cinnamon. Citrus. I just say some type of fruit. Okay, you know, an so apple or something. Yeah. Right. So now take a taste. I don't got to try that again. <laughs> <laughs> and here I've paired that with, we have a... Uh, uh, pepper jack cheese, which has jalapeno in there, okay. and I also have found your uh, any craft wheat cracker. This is really a nice buy, also that fits in a budget. Okay. And that, and then I also picked a smoked mozzarella. That sounds yummy. And then there is a white cheddar with black pepper. Okay. So. This is the other, um, these are called Tuscan chips, it's uh, with herbs. So I've paired it with the white cheddar and the mozzarella, smoked mozzarella, so will go with anything in there. And that's, that's really what I was going to say, mm -hmm. is, Chef, one of the things I get complicated, or I find complicated, maybe I'm the only one who does, but the, all, the, all the different wine selections and the crackers and then with the cheeses, and the cheese prices alone can go anywhere from, okay, I think I'm buying gold, at yeah. you know two hundred dollars a fraction mm -hmm. ounce, you know, or something like that. It's just the, the smellier it is, the better the cheese supposed mm -hmm. to, I guess. Well, <laughs> there are there are people that believe that, but it really depends on your palate, what yeah. you care for. There are a lot of people that do not like, that is like sharp a, a more cheese. distinct aroma in a cheese. So that's why I went with like a smoked mozzarella. You have the best of both worlds. You have a smoky taste. It gives the mozzarella a very nice stringent flavor, and that, and that you can pair with a nice red wine. This one is Rapacano, which is also from the same region as the white, 
and again this is a full body uh, red and it when you open it there's a black chocolate fudge oh. blackberry cinnamon and currants you said the two exactly so <laughs> you know both of the wines are middle price and they're both Italian they are found at Corey's liquor uh, store in Henderson okay. also we're we're very fortunate to have the distributor which is from Italy here in Henderson oh, fantastic. and that so they're uh, I believe in their product I mean I really enjoy it all right, but, question, question on the red, because everyone says room temperature, mm -hmm. but then you end up getting like a really warm glass mm -hmm. of wine. Like and you enjoy it. It's about the pleasure and the enjoyment of drinking. Always the case. Yeah. And you folks enjoy your day. We'll see you tomorrow morning here on Let's Talk News Now. Cheers, ladies. Enjoy our day. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you, Chef. Thank you. Enjoy. It's actually such a, like a nice summer.